welcome to Kids Kitchen Adventures with Lauren. That's me. Today, my kitchen helper is Shirley. Shirley, how old are you? Three. Three. And what's your favorite vegetable to eat? Frozen peas. You like frozen peas? Very good. That sounds super yummy. Well, today you're going to be making some turkey pinwheel sandwiches with me. Does that sound good too? Uh-huh. Awesome. So before we get started with our recipe, we've got to wash our hands and then we'll get cooking. All right, to start our turkey pinwheel sandwiches, it's great to have an adult cut off the crust of a large slice of bread. Usually slices of bread that are a little bit wider than the typical work really well for this recipe. So I'm gonna just cut off all the crust. All right, I'm gonna give you the crustless bread and you're gonna go ahead and use that rolling pin to flatten it up to be nice and thin. Okay. Good work. All right, can you flatten out this one as well? Yeah. Perfect. All right, our next step is to spread on some mayonnaise and mustard onto one side of our flattened out slices of bread. All right, which one do you want to start with? Um, this one. Okay. You can take a knife and take a little bit and then spread it all over your slice of bread. Mustard. And then we'll do some mustard on top. Very good. Mine's all done. That's good. The mustard. Perfect. That looks great. All right. Now we're gonna put on top two slices of deli turkey. You know what? You wanna put those on top of your sandwich? Yeah. Put those on top of your sandwich. Perfect. Now we're going to top on a slice of thin cheese. We're using Colby Jack, but you can use whatever slice or kind of cheese that you like. And the extra thin slices that you can get at the store are really great because that makes rolling them up a lot easier. All right, the last thing we're going to top our pinwheels with is some lettuce. So I have some lettuce leaves here, and then we can go ahead and rip some slices off and put it on top of our cheese. Good, you can rip some little pieces of our lettuce leaf and put them right on. Now it's time to roll up our sandwiches. Do you want to try to roll yours up? Yeah. Start at this end and you're going to try to push it all together and make a really tight roll, 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 roll. That's really big. Oh, very good. That's perfect. Now to keep it together, we're going to take some toothpicks and stick it into our pinwheels where the top part um, is open so that it helps it stay all together. All right, can you put your other toothpick, stick them right in there? Yeah. Next to your other one? Yeah. About four toothpicks will work great. And then with an adult's help, you're gonna go ahead and slice uh, the pinwheels in between each of the toothpicks to make little bite-sized pieces. Mine is so like this, so I Doesn't can... that look so cute? Yeah. So we have little pinwheels, so we're going to cut them all up cut mine. to make them all bite sized. And I'll cut yours up, yep. I'm getting the key. Thank you very much. That looks so great. Mine is so great. <laughs> can I eat it now? Yeah, let's take a bite and try our cute little turkey pinwheel sandwiches. I think those taste pretty good. A fun little sandwich. Yeah. You can find this recipe below this video. Thanks for watching.